Good morning, guys. Happy, uh, happy Wednesday, and welcome to today's video. I am super excited today because I just found this lucky elephant. Can you guys see it? That's so pretty. It uh, has a broken uh, tail. It's a broken tail, but you guys know so what? Bad luck. No, it's good luck when the uh, when the when the trunk is pointed up, and it just came out of the blue. I was just straightening up, and I just found this thing. I feel yeah. like it's a sign because I've been worrying about Ziggy so much the last couple of days. I feel there, like it's a sign. There. We are gonna do outfit of the day just really quick for Sophia because the outfit that she picked today is so super cute. I'm absolutely in love with it. I want to show you guys outfit of the day, Sophie. Right, she's got on this super cute pink shirt with little puffy sleeves and this amazing blue skirt that she bought for back to school. Turn around and show them how cute. Turn around and show them how cute. Do a twirl. No, drop her leash and do a twirl. Yay! She's also got this cute, adorable little doll. Doesn't she match the floor? Outfit of the day, Gabby. What? what? Gabby is sporting this Her nice yoga ball. She's been exercising <laughs> on. <laughs> Gabby is wearing this NSA tank top, top and she's got a pair of old shorts on. Why do you ask? It's the middle of September in Canada, but it's because summer has decided to make a reappearance and we have been boiling lately, haven't we? Not me. We have not been hot at all. Last night at the barn, were you hot? You took off your helmet last night, your hair was plastered to your head, you had sweat pouring everywhere. Have you been hot? Because I was working. Yeah, in the heat, in the super extreme heat. I had to use my legs and stuff. It's been hot. I can't wait to see the footage. I got to jump oh, and ride. Oh, yeah. So, uh, Gabby rode yesterday. Just got too, to jump and ride. But her footage doesn't come out for a couple of days, right? Mm. We save it till Friday. Please, can I yeah. come out? She got to jump, so you guys are going to want to watch that. <laughs> And she was on fire. Did you feel on fire? She was on fire. She was pouring sweat. Hell oh, yeah. <laughs> anyway, I just think that this, these colors, these are like summer colors. I think they look really good on Sophie. I think they suit you. Comment of the day already goes to Olivia F. And she commented, so glad I'm early. I love Dustpan's name. Was she a rescue? No, she was not a rescue. Tell them the story about um, her name. Um, her name used to be Dusty, I believe. Yeah. And when I was a kid, I called her Dustpan, and then we just said, okay, then it's Dustpan. Yeah. So uh, basically, that's exactly what happened. And Nick said, hey, <sighs> we should call her Dusty. And I was like, okay, Dusty works for me. And then Gabby was really little, like almost four, or just just oh no she was almost four and she had never heard the word dusty before so she didn't even know what dusty meant she just assumed that we meant dustpan because that's the only thing that she understood and knew that started with dust so she just kept calling her dustpan over and over and finally it just stuck we were like yep let's just call her dustpan you were a baby anyway i love that gabby i love that you just went and found a comment and picked it did you like that comment oh yes it just showed up on the computer, so I'm like, yes, please. Yeah, so we are starting okay. homework for the day, and this does not look like homework. This okay. looks like our okay. YouTube channel. This. I'm watching. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> so it's cute. It's long. If you did not see the video that we made on Sunday called The Walk, you should <clears throat> watch it. It is so adorable. It is Sam's birthday today, you guys, and we're not celebrating because it's we're just so busy with work and get stuff. Get a cake. You do have to get a cake. Gabby! Ice cream cake. Happy birthday and bye-bye. Uh, Gabby is not one to show emotion, but Sophie is an emotional oh, girl. She birthday. loves it. Happy birthday. My birthday is all month, you know, of October. It's only September. Oh, anyway, we're going to celebrate his birthday, my birthday. this oh, weekend, but we don't want to let the day go by without saying happy birthday and we love him. Alright, you guys. Look in this tree. Oh. Do you see something moving right there? Hello, Look how close she is to us. She doesn't get super, super freaked out. You guys see her? 
That's the baby squirrel oh, that we raised crunch. last year. I wish we had more squirrels right now. That's squirrels crunch. are the funnest. She's under our car. Anyway, we're headed out to do some Halloween shopping. We're looking for, oh, there she is. We are looking for inspiration. Um, tell us in the comments below, what are you gonna be for Halloween? Or do you even know yet? It always takes us forever to figure out what they're gonna be, and it's a nightmare. If we wait too long, there's never any costumes left. Sam and I are officially the same age. I'm 10 months older than him, so this is the beginning of the very short amount of time that we're the same age. My birthday is at the end of November. In two months, I'll be older again. You want those? Mm -hmm. Can I get it? And the second thing I want. What's so special about those? Is that they taste really good. They taste really good? Pringles Halloween chips? Can we get these? Yeah, oh, that's, the cheap that's what I like, chocolate. If you are a boy or a man and you're watching this video, plug your ears and close your eyes now because Sophie and I are, boys, in, man. are in the underwear, underwear section. <laughs> so basically, if you guys don't know, which you probably don't know, but my kids hate underwear. They don't come by it strangely because I hate underwear too. But what happens is... Love. But what happens is what they, when they wear skirts like that, they wear little tiny shorts underneath it. Okay. And I'm trying to explain to Sophie that underwear are so much more comfortable than shorts because they're thinner. I like these. Size four. You think you're gonna fit size four on your butt? No. That's a baby size. <laughs> Let's see. This would be cute. Fruit That's of the Loom. Underwear. They, they don't have a smell, Sophie. <laughs> Why are you smelling underwear? <laughs> because oh, because they have fruit on them? You thought they smelled like fruit? Mm -hmm. That'd be good for you if your butt smelled like fruit, huh? <laughs> Do you like those? Those are cute. How about these? Yeah, they're the same, but they're. Yeah, and they have your size. Uh oh. Okay, but I also want another pair. So I want two pairs of So you want those ones? Look at yeah. now everybody knows what your underwear is gonna look like. Everybody knows Don't. when the next time you're wearing a dress, they're gonna be like, I know what Sophia's underwear looks like. But they won't know what one I'm wearing. That's right, you could be she could have picked orange or green or blue or white or pink. Alright, what other pair do you want? What other pack do you want? These are cute. They have really they have cute little lace on them. I'm, t I'm telling you, underwear okay, is... Please. You like the lace? Yeah. Are you excited? I always feel so proud when I see my family walking together. I'm heading right behind you. I feel like the toys that are out this year so far, I hopefully something better comes out because otherwise Christmas is going to only be horse stuff because there's nothing really good toys wise. Where are you dragging me to? Oh, there we go. This is the aisle we wanted. No, that's not. I want to be a pirate. You want to be a pirate? Okay, we'll go back and look at toys. What kind of pirate? Like this kind of this? No, that's not a pirate. Look at Sam, a Spider-Man costume I might that would fit you. Ketchup bottle. Ketchup? No. A banana. Oh, a banana. That's cool. Come on, I dare you to try that on. I'm a banana pirate. Arr. No. <laughs> I'm a banana, banana pirate. I'm a banana. <laughs> Do the banana song. I'm a banana. Sam, I'm a banana. you'll I'm make a, a good looking look banana. Look at me. Banana. Look at me. Ah. Sliding down. Oh, that's so cool. Look at me. 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 Look at can you guys see the sweat pouring on me? And we took all the air conditionings out. It snowed today in Canada on Dad's birthday. What? It snowed in Edmonton, and this girl's sitting here with her shorts on. I've had the craziest last couple of days, you guys. Yesterday, I learned about sheath cleaning and horses. I didn't even know that that was a thing. And I learned about sheath stones, and I was pretty impressed that I learned all that stuff. It was fun for me. And then uh, today I learned the difference between a paint and a pinto, and it was really exciting. The more you guys teach me and the more that I learn, the more I feel like I want to learn. I see, no, we were out shopping. That's why you guys had to be in there. Uh uh, Macy, you're going the wrong way. Come on, there's Toby. Being outside here on the porch with the dog reminds me of Bailey. I was gonna phone today and see how he's doing, but I totally got busy and forgot. I feel like I have a bellyache today. Do you feel good? 
I feel good. I don't know. We've just had a really low key day. Except I, for I have cold sores. Gabby has cold sores. It's fall, you guys. That's what happens. Yeah. And how are you feeling? Are you feeling good? She's, she's picking comment of the day. Do you feel good? This one. You want this one? Wait, let me I'm read it. I'm just gonna it read it. Okay, Gabby, you wanna read it? I think I really like that comment. <gasps> how do I know you? Have you been ready? Yet? Actually, I have been thinking about this girl all day. I really like. Ew, what she posts. I really like her comments. I really like everything about her Instagram. I like her. The, I watched her riding today on her Instagram and Wait. she looked amazing. No. Oh, look. And she just replied to our comment on her Instagram post. So what a what a sign. Sophie, I think this was, I think God wanted this to be comment of the day. I really do because I kept on seeing her name all day. Everywhere I went online, I saw her name and I think that she's meant to be comment of the day. So let's do it. Comment of the that day. That was the only one that I read. Was it the only one that you yeah. read? It was a good one. I read that one this morning. Gabby is totally enthralled in this comment. You guys are probably all like, who is it? Who's comment of the day? Comment of the day goes to my bae Jed. And she says, I really like Ziggy and I feel like he'd suit you guys well. But at the same time, I feel like you guys would need a slightly smaller, around 15 hands high horse. And one that's kind of been there and done that because it'll have a lot like to teach you all. Even though Ziggy would be able to teach you lots. My horse was 9 when I first got him. He's a 15.2 hand high thoroughbred gelding and he was super green when we first got him. Horses that are 9 and green tend to take longer to get things since they're older than most green horses and they've already got habits drilled in their brain and they can be hard to reverse. That part really hit home with me because I think honestly that Ziggy, he's not green but he's not well trained and that's what everybody says at the barn. Like he, he's lacking something. So I think that that's probably part of it. He's nine and he missed that point where he should have been trained a little better when he was younger. So that's how- Ziggy is nine. Ziggy's nine. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Ziggy's nine too. Bigger horses can be a lot to handle when things go wrong too. So say if a 16 hand high warm blood got spooked and ran and pulled on the lead rope, it'd be pretty scary. But if a 13 hand high hand pony did the same, it wouldn't be as bad, even though ponies can be really strong too. Anyway, I wish you guys the best of luck with whatever happens. You guys deserve it. And Gabby is just saying, if we don't get Ziggy, does that mean we deserve it? <laughs> She's just joking though. Yeah, it's true. I know what we, you mean. Okay, we didn't Ziggy. Get Ziggy, I guess we deserve it. <laughs> <laughs> but I know what you mean. Whatever's meant to happen is gonna happen. It's out of our hands. And all we can do is pray and hope and wish and dream. I feel like it's gonna happen though because I dreamed it. Surprise! Surprise! There's my boy. I keep on in telling his face. in my face. <laughs> I keep on telling everybody at the barn that Ziggy reminds me of Toby, and I feel the same. Toby, for any of you guys who don't know, I told you that. Ziggy yeah, reminds Gabby me of thinks the same thing. Ziggy reminds me of Cookie. Get a spot out of my face. <laughs> yeah, because she's spotted, right? Yeah. <laughs> Cookie, is spot, Cookie is spotted, and and uh, Ew, Ziggy is spotted. Funny. The thing about Toby is this. We got him when he was a He's year crazy. old. A year, he was 15 months old when we got him. He had never been around people. He'd only been in a oh. pen with other dogs. He'd never been outside on a leash. He'd never done anything like dogs usually do. And because he was so old, it took him a whole other year of being with us before he settled in and then now he knows what dogs do. And now he finally knows. It took so long. And that's probably why Ziggy and Toby remind me of each other. And I love Toby so much. Say hi, Toby. Say hi. He likes you guys. He's always staring into the camera. He's so cool. Toby is so addicted to LOL dolls now that we saw them on the weekend. Um, we just FaceTimed Brooklyn and Jacob, and Brooklyn had a little doll in her hand, and Sophie said, oh, what do you have? And she said, it's an LOL doll. So now Brooklyn has one, but poor Sophie doesn't have one. Wait, she had an LOL doll? She had an LOL doll. But you know what? Just, your birthday is you coming. You well, Yes, your birthday is coming. You never know. You can get some LOL dolls. Get me see him in your... Please yours. don't lick me in the mouth again. She will kiss me sometimes when I say, Macy, you give me a kiss. <laughs> so cute. Macy, hey, give me a kiss. Ugh. Teach you and guys, English. And watch and Cookie. Cookie, give me a kiss. Well, watch. She's better. She gives kisses. Now watch this. Toby, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. <laughs> give me a kiss. 
Did we give me a kiss? Give me a kiss. He's like, no, never gonna happen. <laughs> Toby, run away! <laughs> you can totally do something. Anyway, that's guys, it for today. We are gonna end today's video. We'll see you tomorrow when we go I'm back to the horse barn. Too. And hopefully every single time we go there, I pray for news and exciting stuff, information that we can find out and that we'll find out that we're gonna lease Ziggy. So uh, keep on praying if you're praying. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Bye guys. Bye guys. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.